My area of study is second language education, and the title for my own project is self-repair and second language learning. By self-repair, I mean how people modify their language, how they make changes to their ongoing speech um, when they encounter a variety of problems. It can be problems of um, mistakes or problem of inappropriate usage of language. Um, I look into the self-repair behavior of a, two particular groups of second language learners in China, and I um, analyze how their self-repair behavior is impacted by their social cultural, by their social context in their schools. I've received two travel grants. Uh, um, one is in 2013. Um, that travel grant sponsored me to go to um, Bao British Association for Applied Linguistic Language Learning and Teaching Special Interest Group Conference. I did a poster presentation there. In 2014, I got um, a second Wolfson Travel Grant that supported me to do a oral presentation at the annual Ball Conference, which is the British Association for Applied Linguistics. About Wolfson, the most special thing is its history, its linkage with my previous university in China, Xiamen University, because um, the major donor of Wolfson College, Dr. Li Sangti, um, is the grandson of the founder of my previous university, Mr. Tan Kaki. They're both Singaporeans, um, businessmen, and philanthropists. Um, because we have a building that was named after Dr. Li Sangti in Xiamen. And now I can see um, Li Hall and Li Library and Li Court named after him, and a statue of his father in the library, which says benefactor of Xiamen University in China. That really reminds of my um, previous experience. It's not only a place that I can work, it's also a place that I live in. So here I can not only meet people in my own area, I also meet uh, a group of researchers who do fantastic work in other areas. Uh, I have friends who are um, physicists, um, mathematicians, um, who do literary work. The mentor program, uh, I think it is organized by one of the senior members. And um, they send invitations to students saying that we have quite uh, a number of senior members who have expressed their willingness to be paired up with PhD students in their similar field of work. So I got paired up with one senior member um, who did her PhD in a subject that is similar to mine. So um, we can talk about matters academically and other things like how do we um, get over stressful moments, um, how do we handle um, deadlines and like that. My favorite place in Wolfson College, one of it is the Sundial Garden. I like reading there in the summer and, um, in the really warm sunlight. And another place I like is the Li Hall because there are a lot of activities going on there. Um, I go to Zumba class there, I go to aerobics class there um, weekly, so get some time to work out. Another thing is that um, I I played dulcimer, which is a traditional Chinese uh, musical instrument. And uh, the college offered me to store, to put my um, instrument on the stage of the Li Hall so I can go for musical practice. Well, I re really look forward to the 50th anniversary lecture series. And I've seen through the topics and titles. Um, one of them that I'm really interested in is the one that talks about the history of the Cambridge University at the time the college was founded. My friends from the other colleges, they have all have one remark about Wolfson is that you're really lucky to be in Wolfson so you can get on-site accommodation. I mean, this is one thing that make it really different because um, my friends from other colleges, they either get, um, they either cannot get college accommodation or they get uh, off-site college accommodation. But it is actually living on-site in the college that gives me the sense of homeness and the sense of a community.